Hey yarn friends, it's Nancy D here to share a thrift store shopping haul. So I love to go thrift shopping. I haven't been in a very long time just for health reasons. And so today I felt well enough to go. Take enough prednisone and you feel like you can conquer the world. But it really did just wear me out. But anyway, I'd like to show you what I found. Um, I was very pleased with some items. So, um, I'll just start right here. One thing I always look for at thrift stores is uh, baby blankets for our dogs. We have um, six dogs, and so I always look for baby blankets. And this particular thrift store that we went to um, is very well organized and has everything, all the bins labeled. So I always check baby blankets, afghans, and just um, throws. So anyway, I got this baby blanket here for 75 cents. And it'll be nice and warm for the one of the dogs this um, <laughs> this winter. Phoebe just climbed up on top of them and is sitting on the pile of blankets. Uh, here's another baby blanket, 75 cents. Can't beat that. Get back, Phoebe. Get back. You can't get on them. <laughs> and so um, that was great. Here's a bigger throw. It'll go in one of um, the big dogs' kennel. Ginger. So, um, that was a good buy. And then here was a towel for $1.25. And it's a pretty big towel, so that can go in one of the medium sized dog's kittles. Phoebe, get back over here, Becky. And then this one, it'll probably be Phoebe's, is um, just a pink baby blanket. It's really soft. Phoebe, you want this blanket? Look, is this the one you want? She likes sniffing of everything that I. <laughs> so anyway, um, and then Dakota found this piece of fabric to embroidery on. Looks like it's just a scrap piece of fabric. So, um, I can't wait to see what he makes on that. And then, <clears throat> I found this little cup with a jack-o'-lantern on it. Jackalope. Yeah, jackalope, not jack-o'-lantern. Anyway, I thought that was cute and unique, and I love to get weird and unique things, and this was only 55 cents, and it's in a uh, really good shape. There's nothing wrong with it. The handle's a little scratched up, uh, but that just gives character to it, so pick that up. And then um, these were on my list to get at Joann's. I wanted some of those big wooden rings to do the... Um, towel the towel topper things and so I wanted some of those rings and look what I found now these have uh, let's not get it up there so you can see these do have a little hook eye at the top but that just screws right out and so I got two bags of these and they have seven in there you know, seven in each one for dollar fifty five and I already had that on my list for Joann's so that was good I was glad to find that. And then let's see, um, there was a doll stand, and I have lots of the um, 18 inch dolls, and so um, I always, you know, could use more stands for those. I think I have about two or three stands, and so that will give me another one. And what else do I have over here, Phoebe? Um, I picked up this little doodle book. I like to doodle. And this book um, was just 50 cents. All paperback books are 50 cents. So I just picked that up for me to doodle on. And then, um, then I found something I was really excited about. I collect black dolls. I just love black dolls, like folk art dolls. And there was a bag, a plastic bag, with four dolls in it for $5.75. And so I was really excited about that. And at a flea market, I would have probably paid ten dollars per doll for these or more for these larger ones. But anyway, she was in the bag. She is just really cute. I love the um, simplicity of her, and her face is like um, I'm not sure how that's on there. Well, it must be under the material because it's nothing I can feel. So I got her in the bag and then this one is just absolutely adorable 
I love it. I love that. I love her. And so she was in the bag. What do you think, Phoebe? Do we like her? And check out her eyes. That's unusual. But um, I just love the way she looks. And she has a dress, so she has some little pants on. It's under her dress. So that's super cute. And then, then there was two smaller ones in the bag. Phoebe, you're just all up in the way, girl. And this one is just funny as can be. Oh my gosh, how cute is that? And so, um, got her in the bag. And then there was a little boy. And it looks like there's something to hang him by. But anyway, he is super cute. And so, on my dresser, I have all my dolls. And I'll add this to my collection. And then, that's Phoebe squeaking her toy, so, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, and then, as we were walking around, like, I can't see very well. Um, like, I miss a lot of stuff just because I can't see. Everything's kind of, like, blurry to me. And, um, like, even people's faces. Like, if I some, see someone in a store and they're just, like, say hey to me, like, hey, Kayla. And I look at them, like, I can't see their face. I have to, like, recognize their voice. Um, or they had to say something that clues me into who they are. <laughs> and so, um, I totally walked past this, I don't know how many times, and did not see these. And so, uh, Dakota was like, you're not going to get that yarn? And I was like, what yarn? <laughs> there was two boxes of yarn there. And so, the skeins were 75 cents each. And they, they don't smell musty and all, at all, they smell fresh. So here was this Craft Smart, and it was 75 cents, so that was a good buy. <coughs> and then, um, here's a, I love the yarn, 75 cents. And this color is cream, so that'll be a nice color to add to my stash. And then here's this other I Love This Yarn in the colorway Cranberry. So that'll be pretty. And I might even pair these two together to do a stocking or something. That would be really pretty. And there was another I Love This Yarn in Cranberry. Again, 75 cents. Um, and I do have some of this already. Orchid. I do have some of this already, and I have a big jumbo skein of it, but, you know, for 75 cents, I can just put it in my stash and get to it sooner or later. And then, also, there was this, um, Burnett Camouflage, and this is an older label, but, um, I went ahead and got it because I'm going to work that up on the Addy, because I don't have that many men's hats, and this winter I plan to give out some hats at the, um, soup kitchen and so I need some more men colors so I picked that up and then the last one is just an impeccable um, royal but again it was 75 cents and they had a lot more yarn they had some that um, I just didn't need because I already have several of those skeins in my stash already and then they had some like with older labels that you could you know definitely tell that you know, they've been around a while, been in someone's stash for a very long time. But um, these are the ones I picked out. I just picked ones that I thought I could use. I didn't want to just buy them all just to hoard them. So I was very pleased with that. It was a great day at the thrift store. So um, thanks for watching. I just wanted to share with you my findings. No one would be excited about me finding yarn except for y'all. <laughs> See you all very soon.